What's up you guys? It's your boy James here. How you doing? Uh, just bringing y'all a new video today. What we're going to be doing over here is trimming up three live oaks and trimming a few shrubs. Um, what I'll be doing here is turning the camera around shortly and uh, letting y'all see me do some trimming on it. It's mainly just lifting the exterior up on them. We got a little bit of interior work, but these customers here take pretty good care of these trees. They call us every few months. This is the second job of the day, guys. I didn't get a chance to do the first. I didn't get a chance to uh, video the first job we were on. But like I said, we got two live oaks, uh, some shrubs. I got the guys in the back doing the, the live oak in the back. So let's get started, guys. All right, guys. Like I was saying, these are the two live oaks. Not real big. We keep up on them. Like I was saying, every few months we come over and lift them up. What we got here, guys, is we're going to lift this one up, lift this one up, clean it out. Uh, let me show you the shrubs we're going to be doing. That's the big live oak in the back. As you can see, we're just going to pop it up, get the dead wood back out of it, and, and lift it up, like I was saying, get it off the roof. These are the shrubs we're going to be doing. We're going to be using these bad boys. We bought this not too long ago. It's a HL994K, guys. And let me tell you, it's definitely worth the money. They're pretty costly, but man, let me tell you, they last and they're very good. Got the swivel in, definitely worth having. That's the other little live oak. Don't look too bad from here, but it does got a good amount of work in it, guys. Um, that's the customer's car. They're going to be moving it. Let me see if I can get you a better view. All right, guys. All that over the driveway is getting real low, so what we're going to do is just walk around it with the gas-powered steel pole saw and lift it up. I'll be right back with you. Sorry about that, guys. A uh, customer needed to talk to me. Now I'm going to show you what we're going to be trimming the pole, uh, trimming the live oaks with. This is an HT133, guys. Steel pole saw. Definitely worth having. So if you're just starting a tree business, you definitely don't need steel but if you want it for a long term i would definitely recommend it because we get about two to three four years out of them if you take care of them now what we're going to do guys is get started on trimming this live oak right here i'll be right back with you all right guys what we're going to do is i trim this one behind you i got two of them in the front and these shrubs the phone fell off what i had it sitting on i forgot my tripod today but I'm going to check it one more time. We're going to trim this exterior, and I'm going to show y'all how a live oak should be trimmed up, guys. Let's get it. y'all could smash it for me that would be awesome and again thank y'all for all the support guys i hope y'all enjoy this video please hit that subscribe for me That is how you print it up to the next level. Whether it's a big tree or a small tree, you can release the weight off the exterior. The way that tree is, if you take your arm, guys, and you put a cinder block in your hand, what's it gonna wanna do? It's gonna wanna tag down. It's gonna wanna tug down. So release all that weight to take the weight off the base of it. Always take your cuts back to the base and always seal them up with printing seal, guys. On any oak, that's the proper way to do it. Just a little tip, guys. Take care of your live oaks. 
keep the dead wood out of them. That helps keep the ants out of them. Ants love dead wood, guys. Comment down below. Let me let me know what y'all think, guys. Let me know what y'all want. In the minute, we're, we're gonna finish trimming this one, and I'm gonna let y'all trim let let y'all watch me trim these shrubs really fast. And then uh, we'll see where we're at. I'll see y'all shortly. Got my tripod at home. Like I said, guys, this is how you lift the exterior up. Like I said, that's the tree in the back. Just a few centers. Like I said, we trim it probably twice every six months to a year, so it never gets really bad. But guys, you seen the tree before I trimmed it. Keep in mind, we got a few on the interior, but we don't like to take it thin on the interior. The oaks look good thick. Um, I'm gonna show you. Sorry about that guys, I want to show y'all what it looks like from the road. That's the tree I started on and then the camera fell. So that's the exterior of it now. See how level that is guys? I still got some more right there I didn't get to. I wanted to show y'all the exterior part of it. I'm going to get this trimmed. I'll be back with y'all shortly and we're going to go ahead and trim them shrubs. Got a few shrubs here. So like I said again, guys, I hope y'all enjoy the video. I will be posting a lot more tree videos coming up. Hit the thumbs up for me and leave me a comment if y'all like these types of videos. And if you'd like me to keep doing them, I can do them probably a few times a week if that's what y'all would like. But anyway, guys, I'll be back with y'all shortly. I hope you enjoyed this. Now we're going to get ready to trim these shrubs up. But look at all that brush on the ground just from that little tree, guys. Guys, this whole video so far, which I'm going to do some editing when I get home, we just trimmed these exteriors up in about 30 minutes, 20 minutes, guys. So I'll get right back with y'all. Alright, guys, we got the trees done. Now let's get these shrubs done. We'll get this stuff cleaned up and we'll be done today. We got the back oak done. They're cleaning up back there. We've been here probably an hour and a half and we got about 30, 45 minutes left. Another job accomplished. This, was a, this is what I'm talking about guys, about the swivel. It really comes in handy guys. Let's get it done. different yard man and he whacked the hell out of them but anyway they don't want me to do nothing but barely trim them so this ends high but this is what they want so it looks a lot better the only thing we got left to do now guys is trim this one and take this dead shrub out here they don't want to trim these they told me not to we're gonna take this dead shrub out but guys overall view 
Guys, I really hope y'all enjoy the video. Like I said, I'm going to try to hit 200 likes on this video. So if you could, smack that like for me. Uh, share it out and hit that red button for me. Y'all have a good day, guys. Thank y'all for watching.